Hey there, good morning everybody. How's it going, eh? Fred here from the Canadian Daily. And what do I got on for today? Well, I don't know. It's kind of misty foggy here today. Uh, it's not too bad. Uh, hopefully it's clearing off a bit, so I'm really hoping to get the uh, quad car out today. Um, the church that's right there behind Nan's, I want to get it up above that and do a, a point of interest um, circle around that because it's really cool. So I'm going to do a whole video of the church uh, inside and out. Um, that would be put up on, of course, uh, as a separate video um, once I get back home and edit it all, of course. And um, it has a lot of significance to me, that church. And of course, I'll talk about that in the, uh, the video when it comes comes to uh, fruition. Uh, this is just sort of uh, an overview behind me of Nan's here. Kind of went in the full circle there, but uh, beach is down the road a little bit and uh, try to get down there at some point in time. Um, we'll see how it goes. Anyway, uh, the uh, Vita prompt topics uh, in the past couple days really didn't interest me so much. Uh, I don't even affect me actually because some of them. Uh, like yesterday's with the snapchat thing. I don't even use snapchat. So maybe I should maybe I shouldn't let me know down in the comments below and um, In the meantime, um, I'm just gonna continue vlogging while I'm here at Nan's for the week and relaxing and uh, Chilling out, uh, you know Nan's doing pretty good. She's in her early 90s. Uh, her knees are kind of Going on her but other than that uh, she's uh, in excellent mind and everything so uh, we'll have a chat with her on here and get her on the vlog eventually this week and uh, yeah we'll go from there uh, I don't know so anyway that's it this is just the morning uh, part of the today's vlog so I gotta actually edit and put up yesterday's vlog sorry it's late but you know um, due to the traveling uh, and time zone and all that business uh, just never really came to light yesterday so i apologize for that folks and uh, i'll get that up today um but anyway um let's see what happens for the rest of the day okay shall we and uh, i know there's some uh, good homemade food uh, waiting to be had a little later on today we're discussing what we're going to have today and of course when you come to newfoundland you got to have fish and uh, you know i i eat fish morning noon and supper and probably bedtime again so uh fish is like you know, the number one staple that that's of my diet, then chicken. So, anyway, we'll see what's going on, and uh, I'll catch you in a few minutes. Do yeah. want some tea or no? And toast. So we, so we tried, attempted to fly moose, but it was just too windy. It's so windy. It is really blowing hard here. So I can't wait to get it and fly it down over the beach there and the river and hands up top of the over the south areas. And down that direction. Oh yeah, it's gonna be nice next couple days it's supposed to be fine, so hopefully we can get a couple flights in and get some great footage then. But for now, we're kind of ground. Supper, and I'll see you in a bit. A couple years ago, my grandmother came up with this, well, ingenious invention that she calls her dining table for the crows. And we always say, Nanny's crows come to dine. And uh, there's the table. It's a wood stump with a piece of wood stuck to the top of it. And uh, 
all the table scraps and that she wants dumped there and uh, the crows come to eat and uh, she feeds them quite well and they clean it right off so we're gonna put a gourmet feast over for them now and uh, see what happens the gourmet supper is awaiting come on crows man these crows And since they're by the church, can we say holy crow?